On the back of this tragic story, parents are being encouraged to be cautious about minders for their children while they're away. The South African National Coordinator, uh, Bianca van Aswegen, says that the case of Jocelyn Smith should be warning, a warning sign to parents not to wait more than 24 to 48 hours to open a missing person's case. According to stats, a child goes missing every five hours in South Africa. Little Jocelyn's case, once again, should be a learning lesson regarding the safety of our children and also the process of what to do when a child or a person goes missing. Firstly, there is absolutely no waiting period in South Africa to report a person or a child as missing. People still tend to the belief they have to wait 24 hours before having opened the case. That does not exist. Please go and open a missing person's case at your nearest police station immediately. It's called the SAPS 55 form. The quicker it gets open, the quicker action can be taken. As it's very important, the first 24 hours to 48 hours is our crucial hours when a child goes missing. Please also contact us directly at Missing Children South Africa so we can start assisting immediately. It's very important, the quicker action gets taken, the quicker we can get that child back within that 48 hours. We know it's not safe anymore. We are just human. We think we can trust everybody, but there's so many ulterior motives these days that we have to really think with who we leave our children. So if you do have to find someone that you have to leave your child with due to work-related issues or having to go out, please make sure that you trust that person. If it's someone that you hire, please make sure that you've got references on that person. When it comes to family members, family, friends, and people within our community, unfortunately, we have seen cases where this is quite prominent, where that is the person that has actually taken the child or done something to the child. So we need to look out for little red flags. For in, um, example, inappropriate touching, too much attention to a certain child, giving uh, the child too many things, you know. If a child comes to you and they tell you they feel uncomfortable with a certain person, listen. Open your ears and listen to what they're saying to you because there might just be something wrong.